See, I think this is, um, as your report just suggested then, lots of people were expecting to see the figures go down today. Um, so it's really sad and disappointing to see this rise again um, happening. Now, I think there's kind of three different things we need to be doing here. Um, I took a little look just before I came in to chat to you guys at the number of vacancies that it's estimated are out there at the moment. And according to the Office of National Statistics, it's 458,000, uh, 458,000 um, vacancies at the moment. Now, as you just mentioned, with 2.49 million people unemployed, that means that there's over five people, um, five unemployed people for each job. And that's quite scary. So. For me, you've got to look at making sure that people are um, employment ready, they, they know what they're doing with their CVs and interview skills, they've got the self-confidence and self-belief to be able to go for the jobs. We've also got to be encouraging businesses as well and helping them to grow and helping them to start employing more people. And then thirdly, we've also got to start encouraging people to consider setting up their own businesses too. Sure. Th that was precisely the point I was going to come to next. I wanted to hear your three points. But your last one, it seems to me that wealth creation, and particularly online and the internet, that's not the problem. It's job creation. You can make a fortune, but only employ two or three people. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I've got online businesses myself as well. And, you know, I, I really do believe that, you know, if you look at some of, the, um, some of the values of these online businesses at the moment, you know, anyone can set up a business if you've got a good idea, if you've got, um, you know, some basic skills there's nothing stopping you and there's lots and lots of resources out there um, that encourage people to set up their own businesses and online if you think about it if you're going to set up a, st a shop in a high street it's going to cost you a lot of money in terms of the overheads of setting up that shop whereas if you just go online and set up a business online the overheads and the startup costs can be quite low and as you say Michelle Dubry lots of advice and guidance online as well thank you very much for joining us this afternoon thank you